so I got a cleaning bug up my hoodie hoo. So I think hoodie hoo was the last thing you got. Anyway, so I have washed Anthony's bedding before you ask. Anthony, I don't use the same bedding because um, I like to be a crocodile. Um, then I don't know, it just kind of snowballed from there and I cleaned back here. There was a bunch of soap from where one of the kids had knocked over um, soap. Duh. Um, Um, and so I had to clean it up. I'm trying to get this foil to sit right. Um, and then, so Xander's dresser is now out here. Of course, the rolly cart, there's a bunch of things back here right now that actually just don't go. Um, the rolly cart with the vegetables on it is back here, and so is the trash can. But you're currently sitting on the shelving that is attached to the wall, which I have repurposed for plastic wrap, parchment paper, wax paper, aluminum foil, and my cookie sheets. Pre-cut parchment paper. Had to cheat. Had to look. And peanut butter. The peanut butter is weird, but hold on, I'll show you. Sanders dresser, washer, baggie. <laughs> and this battery just came off the charger and wants to die already anyway so we'll use it until it goes then uh, all of this has been mopped and cleaned out uh, along with the hall which I need to put and then that's all gone right now I need to put the cat boxes back but this is much more open my glass bottles and then like I said cat box poop bear and then I decided I don't need that anymore it's more of in the way and I need to put the other bins up the uh, painter like ones need to also be brought back in here and then pretty much I think I'm done. We'll see. That was definitely a new intro to uh, what I do. And I just noticed, now that I'm looking back on it, there is fabric softener in my sink right now. Anyways, welcome you guys back to me cooking. So this one doesn't have a name. And I kind of just threw some together some stuff. I'd seen a picture on Pinterest, it looked good, and so I had gotten the, a hold of these potatoes, they were on sale, so we grabbed both packs, it is a house full of people who love potatoes, I'm going to add corn on the cob, I ended up adding some chicken thighs to it, to kind of stretch it out a little more, it had a good flavor, and I will end up chopping up a smoked sausage and adding it in there along with some chicken broth and that's what we ended up having for dinner. I cooked this on manual setting. I'd probably have to say we cooked it for about 20 minutes and it was pretty good as you guys will see. And then Anthony said it reminded him of a crab boil, which I don't know why I'm craving that. Never had one, actually. And I'm not a big crab fan. Um, so, but this is what we had. It was easy. I am starting to really get into using my Instant Pot for full-on meals. And I just... Feeling silly, I didn't come around sooner than this. Anyway, so here me is who can't talk. <laughs> here I am cooking dinner. And then I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'll let the rest play out. It was, like I said, quick and easy dinner. Thank you for joining us, and I'll see you tomorrow. Love you guys.